Christian Bale. <laughs> with ACDC. I would say like Roger, but there's zero chance he's standing in the queue. I would love to get one more, uh, one more crack at him. We'll fall wide. We will fall wide. What's one thing you always do when you visit London? I eat sticks and sushi a lot. Have a scone. I'm a big scone and clotted cream fan. Go out. Every time. Or like right when you get in, or is it just at some point during the trip? No, not right when I get in. After, after the tournament. <laughs> There's a coffee shop in in Southfields called Drop Shop. So yeah, it's a pretty good coffee shop. All the time I'm having Five Guys. Really? Yeah, because we don't have that in Italy or in Monaco. It's gonna be two cheeseburgers, double cheeseburgers, but simple like cheese and ketchup, barbecue sauce, and three kilos of fries. Which two players are you bringing to sit in the Wimbledon queue with? Okay, uh, I'll bring Tommy, because he's can make like a, any boring situation somewhat entertaining, I feel like. And then I'll take Riley too, and I don't know why I'll take Riley, because he, he's going to complain the entire time. Yeah, I'd probably take Fed and Nadal. You can ask, just ask, ask them lots of questions about, about what not. Yeah, as you said, they can't go anywhere. It's a good time. It's gonna be two Italians, uh, Lorenzo Sonego and Yannick Sinner. I'd bring Bruno and Andre Saab. He's, he's still on the tour, he's not playing anymore, but I'd bring him. I would say like Roger, but there's zero chance he's standing in the queue. Regardless, regardless of if there's a line or not. Maybe like Gael, he'd be fun. Like I feel like he'd like be a, he'd get like the crowd involved. Probably Nick. Probably, and, uh, yeah, probably Tefa, funny guy. How are you guys gonna pass that time? We'll find ways. We will find ways. If there's anyone that can find ways, it's probably us too. Uh, who's your dream opponent to play on grass and why? My dad. Oh, wow. I feel like I cannot lose against my dad. Uh, I guess you got to say Fed on center court, but the results probably wouldn't look great for me. Well, I did play Roger on uh, at center at Wimbledon, so for me, it came true. I got my ass kicked, um, and it was a lot of fun. Was it a dream? It was a bit of a nightmare. But then a dream, and then a nightmare, and then a dream, and then we finished, and I walked back past all of his trophies, and I was like, yeah, this guy knows what he's doing, so. I, honestly, I'd love to play Fed, obviously. Not, not from perspective of like, I want to play him on grass, because I think that's a good match, but um, I just, I would love to get one more, uh, one more crack at him, especially on grass. Sampras, Borg, and Federer. One's your doubles partner, and you're playing against the other two. Who are you picking as your partner? I played doubles with Roger a few times already, so um, I'm gonna go with him as my opponent this time and choose Pete Sampras as my doubles partner. I'll probably say play with Pete, as he was, and then play against Roger and Borg. I would play with Fed or Sampras. Borg can be on the other team. Yeah, I'd take Federer against Borg and Sampras, yeah. So you know, hopefully he can do all the work, yeah. I'll play with Pete. I'll play with Pete just because he's like one of my favorite players ever. Picking Roger all night long. Uh, Why Roger? Because he's Roger. Because I grew up like watching his matches and cheering for him. The first one is, if you could start a tennis tradition, what would it be and why? Car racing, you know, in the tennis tournament. No backhands. I would say maybe only slice would be fine. I feel like that, that would be beneficial to me. I'm selfish. Walkout music just adds to the atmosphere, I think. The one fan from the crowd after the match is coming to play a few points with the winner. It's a nice tradition. Yeah, for a kid, I think it would be special. If you could place a new grass court tournament anywhere in the world, where would it be and why? Oh, in Poland. In Poland, because, uh, you know, we don't have uh, an ATP event, so why not? Like, let's bring a grass court event there. Maybe indoor grass court. Okay. <laughs> Scotland. Uh, I'd probably say like Manhattan Beach because that's where I live, so I don't have to go anywhere. I mean, in Italy, it would be amazing. I think it has to be on the north because in the south center, Rome or the south is pretty hot, so it's not going to be easy. Uh, Venice. Wow. You really on the water. Through. That's nice. On the water. <laughs> <laughs> Maui, Hawaii. It's a beautiful place. Yeah, you can go surfing there. Exactly. I would go Australia. I love Australia, and I think we've had a pretty rich tradition of history there uh, on grass, so I think probably Melbourne. Who would you want as your doubles partner? Tom Holland as Spider-Man or Robert Pattinson as Batman? I think Spider-Man. 
Because I think, you know, like he can shoot and catch the ball. Nice. And then just, you know, just, you know, do whatever he wants to with it. Batman. Holland's way too short. Strength and height. He's not covering much ground, even though he's webs. So how you do it, Wes? Ooh, tough question. They both have a lot of skills, but even though I love Batman, I think in doubles, Spider-Man is going to be better. It's going to be anywhere. No winners. I'm just going to see them bench and look at him like catching all the balls. If you win Wimbledon and go to the ball, what song are you requesting they play? <laughs> put, put ACDC in that Wimbledon bath. Yeah, that, that, that would be great. I think fitting well, like well, the atmosphere. Candy shop by 50 Cent. All right, you're bringing a whole new vibe. To yeah, that. that's why. Just make it different. Something upbeat, something to get me moving and dancing. I'd probably be a few drinks deep by then, so something to get me going. I want to hear like uh, something by Lil Uzi. Which British actor would you like to play you in a biopic about you? Tom Holland can do it if he wants. Tom Holland could like could play me, but like the the, the I'm worried about the height. Put Daniel Craig as James Bond, you know. Nice. Pretty cool. Daniel Craig in as Hubert Hercatch. Yeah, that's that's I not see it. that's I not a bad. See it. Daniel Craig, yeah, Bond. I feel like a bit of a silver fox, Colin Firth, a bit older. Nice. Could be me in about 30. Nice. That's yeah. kind of like looking back. Yeah. You know, like looking back at the life of Tanasi. Exactly. Yeah, I feel like, feel like that's me. Oh, Christian Bale. Christian Bale. Christian Bale, the Batman. Okay. Grandissimo. Nice. Done. Done. You're, you're free. 